we got to play with the new 115 horsepower Mercury 4 stroke. She's available with either the Command Thrust 2.38 to 1 gear case or as standard with the 2.07 to 1. And I've got to say, she was just great in both configurations. It's very rare that we actually get the chance to use two different exact same boats fitted up with two different configurations. So it was great for Mercury to put them both on display for us on the Gold Coast. The difference was amazing. The performance levels on paper don't describe the difference in the drive. The smaller gear case worked perfectly and more than satisfying for any prospective buyer. But the difference that we experienced when we took the command thrust option for a drive was really quite surprising. It had enormous thrust. It had enormous bite. There was not a hint of cavitation and the power to rate direct to the water, which means overall performance and economy to you, was outstanding. The 115 is, um, well, not only, not only is it significantly lighter than the direct competition, but the, but the thing about the thing about it is that um, you, it, it's developing torque slightly higher up the range than, than the than the 90. Um, however, the thing is with, with that particular engine, having the ability of a command thrust gearbox actually makes a big difference. Now, on the two boats that we tested back to back between the between the um, between the standard gearbox and the command thrust gearbox. Um, the, um, the command thrust was definitely the way to go if you're, if you're going to be running a, if you're going to be towing around kids and, and carrying a family around and things like that. And the reason is, is that it, it actually uh, uh, gets the, the engine torque down into thrust more effectively. Whereas you can get away with, say, the stand, in, where you can get away with a standard gearbox in the 90, in my opinion, for all round usage, whether it be on the cat that we tried and whether it be on, on the two Quintrexes that we tried, um, it, it's definitely, in my opinion, the way to go. When John and I were out doing the testing, we found that the, um, the command thrust um, equipped engine, um, planed at lower speeds, had better mid range fuel economy because, again, the engine torque was being, translate, being converted to thrust more effectively and was slightly more efficient at wide open throttle with a slightly higher speed. But the main thing about it was it was able to plane at lower revs because you had a, a fatter, you had a, a, a coarser pitch, fatter bladed prop, which was able to keep the boat on the plane at lower revs. And to do it back to back, don't get me wrong, I, I think the, the standard gearbox would be fine if you were gonna run a light, lightweight bass boat or something like that and you wanted that top end to, to punch away. But you know, for normal usage on, on, on the Quintrex, the, I found the command thrust box made a big difference. Same boats, same day, same time, same engines. But you know what? The command thrust just gave that hull a little bit extra. What a ripper job from Mercury right through their new engine range. Read all about it in upcoming issues of Trader Boat magazine.